Hey, what's up guys? I'm back. Searing Star MJ back with more WWE 2K16. And the law has happened ever since the last uh, part or last video. You saw this. But a lot of proof. So I've been, uh, lately I had been playing this game a lot. Just to, you know, kind of perf not really perfect, but try to get better at this game. And. It's going quite a bit, quite uh, smoothly, so I'm pretty happy to see how this will go. Um, so today, I'm going to be doing this normal gameplay, because why not? And I've also been doing something else lately, where I did uh, WWE Universe. I will do that next time, because I just thought, you know what? Why not? So I'm just going to do random gameplay just to show off my created diva, which I kind of like tweaked a little bit and now like I pretty much have it pretty much where I want it to be, where I want her to be, but uh, maybe the gear might change a little bit, but I don't know. We'll see how that goes, but in an all match because why not? I'm probably not going to... I'm probably not going to be great still at, like, trying to win matches, but I'm going to try at least to, you know, get, you know, show a little bit more than just throwing punches and Irish whips and submissions and pins, that, I don't know, that craziness. So, I'm going to go ahead and go to Custom Superstars. I made, like, other ones. <laughs> I don't know, this was a complete random one out of nowhere, Amy Lane. Don't ask me why I came up with that name. That was literally just the one thing that came in my head. It sounds like Amy Lee, but I didn't do Amy Lee from from uh from that band. Although I do love that band. Hey, if it, this this one's dedicated to you, Dark Sanger, Hundred <laughs> Heaven, a good friend. That's me. That's who I made. And then this is also another one of those random guys. Random ones, Josh. Don't ask me why I came up with that. I don't want a manager. And, um, I think I'm just gonna do the divas. I don't know. Um, but hopefully, I mean, everyone's talking about the next game to be WWE 2K17, even though there's gonna be like a, uh, there's rumors about a brand split, or rather, the rumors about the brand uh, split is actually becoming a reality. Which is exciting. I am so happy. So, I'm just going to do it against, uh, let's just... I'm going to do it against Eva Marie because... I'm pretty sure you guys want nothing more than for me to beat up some... Than for me to just, you know, take out someone who really sucks at wrestling, and that is none other than Eva Marie. She just, she's a terrible wrestler. I don't want this on SmackDown. And you have also the option, I think, yeah, I think I told you they could make it like a, it's like a title match, but I'm not going to make it a title match because actually, I haven't told you guys this, but I, I mean, like I said, I've been doing universe mode. And right now, my creative diva, Imogy, she is currently the NXT Women's Champion, and she's feuding against Paige for that title. So, I kind of want to give you just a little peek onto that. Uh, probably just a little sneak peek up to, like, uh, Extreme Rules at NXT to there, and then you'll see actual, like, episodes of, of WWE, of WWE, of the universe. Such so just... Just supporting you, so it's not just random gameplay, although I will do that uh, a couple times, but I don't know, you probably won't say it as all. I, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to do this. But I also created random arenas until Dawn don't have to be probably from the game, but that was a terrible, and then this, and then this, uh, another show is called Unknown Storm, because why, why the hell not? Oh yeah, and you, like I said, I, I, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but yeah, you can pick different shows and arenas to put this in. 
Like you have it on Raw, SmackDown, NXT, WWE Superstars, SummerSlam 2014, Money in Bank uh, 2014, Battlegrounds, Payback, uh, Tables, Ladders, and Chairs, and Stairs. Eh. That was so dumb of them to add the stairs part. Just what the hell? It's just TLC. It's not TLCS. It's just TLC. Hilariously, ironically, I'm pretty sure that's a uh, technology learning channel. I don't know. I don't know. Something like that. I don't even know. But I know it has like shows like my six my six hundred pound life. I know, uh, Survivor Series, Hell in a Cell, Night of Champions, Royal Rumble 2015, Fastlane, WrestleMania 31, Extreme Rules 2015, NXT Arrival, Main Event, Elimination Chamber, and that's pretty much all you have for now until you do things to unlock the other events and shows and whatnot. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on a, you know, because how about NXT, because why not? And I'm not putting this as, ti as a title match because like I said, the title is on my creative uh, woman wrestler and uh, she's currently in a feud, so no title matches, just a normal match. And entrance is on, so which is good. So you guys can kind of see their entrances. I'm probably going to skip even Marie's because I'm pretty sure y'all are going to be bar uh, barfing. And I would hate to put y'all through that kind of pain. I would hate to put y'all through that kind of suffering. So I'll just skip it. And you know, it'll be fun. It'll be hilariously, hil uh, hilariously fun to watch. So yeah, just, you know, it'll be good old women's wrestling. Not diva wrestling. I will punch someone if someone says diva. I'm gonna say, I uh, get used to me saying woman wrestler in this series, in this Let's Play now. Yes! Okay, I swear, like, in the- okay, let me shut up for right now. The following Diva contest is Kittle Girl Let's Go, making their way in the ring from Austin, Texas, the NXT Women's Champion, Nicole! Yep. <laughs> I made her entrance pretty much like pages. There was really nothing else that I could come up that I really could come up with that could really there was nothing else that I could really find that could actually fit. So this was like the best I could come up with. Um and sadly there's no custom entrances. There was in the in the SmackDown vs. Raw. But not on these games. Just why the hell? What the hell? Ew, okay. Skipping. Yeah, I'm pretty sure now you guys want to see wrestling. But like I said, get me get used get used to me saying women's women wrestling because uh Yeah, this was one of the uh, new parts of the move that I kind of that I that I feel like it should be just more shown off rather than just a bunch of punches and suplexes and shit. <laughs> oh God! I don't want to win it. I don't want to lose the enter. Sorry, she sucks. Nope, nope, nope. I didn't want to pin her. I wanted to just. I was trying to like get her up, but I guess I couldn't remember how to do that. wrestling just because WWE changed, um, uh, they basically retired the word Divas, thank God, and they're now called Women Wrestlers. Woo! 
I think that's an Ar no, that's not an Argentine backbreaker. I know I put in some interesting stuff such as like the PTO, the backstabber, um, pop up power bomb, and a spear because why not? Oh yeah, and, and suplexes. Yes. No, this is not Suplex City, guys. This ain't Suplex City, bitch. Suplex City, Suplex City, bitch. But no, I'm not doing that. Just. I want to be able to like get her kind of. Want to get her um. Her momentum as, as like less as possible. Get as low as possible so that I can so that I can be able to execute this properly and not have to worry about her kicking out because that's I think that's like my worst fear now. No, that's like kind of like my worst fear is her kicking out of my finishers. Well, not well, not that I want. No, 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 that was too overly dramatic. Whoops. I'm not sure who you're talking about, Michael and uh, Jerry and JBL. Yeah, those are the commentators who are on here. I and this is hilarious. You want to know what's really stupid? Okay, because Jerry Lawler says he loves Divas, and then, uh, like, he says he loves Divas, but then he goes off making really weird sexist remarks and that. Just not, just, just not very pretty at all. Get out, ref! I don't want to hurt you, ref. If you saw, like, how, like, kind of, not her health, but kind of whatever it is, it's kind of like, uh, yeah, I, that's how, that's, I want to be able to get her down there as possible just so I can be able to, just so I can be able to, uh, you know, execute what I need to properly without having to worry about kicking, without her kicking out. Are you for real? I basically was able to have some resiliency against that, so. because for the giggles why not and I'm trying to like pay attention to how long I've been recording on this although I think I want to record like maybe a few more episodes of just random gameplay before you know like complete random gameplay not like uh like Stardust gameplay or anything like that not quite yet I just wanted to do just random gameplay before I, before like kind of give you guys a little sneaky Sneaky peek. What the hell does that mean? It's, yay! A little sneaky peek in um into universe before I start actually uploading. Before I get real with uh, with putting up episodes. 
I mean, there will be some points in Universe where I won't record, but, I mean, I mean, after this little sneaky peek up to, like, Extreme Rules and the next, and the NXT events, I'll probably show you that uh, pretty soon, but, I'm gonna go ahead and exit that. Why the, why would I want to have a rematch? Just, no. And I think I'm slowly starting to pick up my wins, but, I mean, just, yeah. But anyway, that's basically what I wanted to kind of show you. I've learned a lot. I know, it's crazy, just, just to show you how much I've learned up to this point, and, um, I mean, especially with playing Universe a lot, holy crap, just, I, I can't even imagine. Um, and I will also be doing, uh, my career. There's a 2K showcase, and there's creations, and there's my WWE. What? I don't, I don't think, oh, this is edit superstars, edit teams, statistics, and title management. You know, I'm gonna check to these really quick. Because this was only like 15 minutes, and I don't want to make them all just a bunch, like, So these are my, uh, just ranking statistics, um, top 10, okay, so here's my top 10 most superstar diva wins, or superstar, you know, superstar, or, well, I think the women wrestlers are also called superstars, but top most superstar wins. Well, it's me with 11 wins, John Cena with one win, Kalisto with one win, Hideo with Tommy with one win, and Kevin Owens with one win. Um, top 10 most played, uh, superstars. Okay, this is me. Imogy with 34 times. Josh with 6. Heavenly with 5. Natalia with 4. Paige with 4. Natalia, I mean, not Natalia. Layla with 3. Dolph Ziggler with 3. Ryback for three, John Cena for three, and Tyson Kidd for... No, John Cena for two, and Tyson Kidd for two. I don't want to make this like a super short episode. I just wanted to... When I mean super short, I mean like 15 minutes, just because I feel like... I don't know, I feel awkward having to split this thing up to like... Like, any less than like... Any less than like nine minutes. This just doesn't... Uh, I feel awkward for that. Okay. So top 10 most played match type. Uh, single with no manager 95 times. Tag team normal match 10. Single with manager versus with manager. Uh, 6. Triple threat 4 times. Fatal 4 way 3. Single no manager versus with manager. 2. Ball count anywhere single with 2. Um, Elimination Tag, Normal Match, 1, Battle Royal, 6 Vanda Over the Top Rope, 1, Hell in a Cell Single, 1, and then my WWE Highlights, Win Ratio for Title Matches, 1, because I really only had like one random title match, because why, because, eh, okay, and then, um, Royal Rumble wins, uh, zero. Number of wins with all parts at Critical, one, uh, zero. Number of ring collapse, can knockouts, zero. I know, like, really, Big Show will accomplish something like that. Number of finisher reversals, six. <coughs> okay, uh, win-loss record, um, have 15 wins, which is 15%. Um, 81, um, no, no, I have, a uh, one time that I've, I've ended up in a draw, which was, like, 1%, Eight, 80 losses, um, at 84%, which I'm sure that will soon pick up, um, I mean, not that it will soon pick up, but I think the wins will pick up a little bit more since, no, I seem to learn a little bit more about this game. Um, wins by pinfall 12 times at 81%, uh, is by submission 100%, uh, 0%, by KO, uh, 0%, DQ 2 times at 13%, um, count out by once at 6%, and other method 0 times at 
And this loss is by Pinfall 59 at 75. Uh, losses by losses by 19 times, 23 percent. Zero by KO, zero by DQ, one by the countout, one percent, and by other methods, just one percent. And number of times abilities have been used. Uh, Ring Escape eight. Oh, you scroll through this. Oh, ha, ha. Mm, interesting. Well, you learn something new every time you play this game. You, you learn something new. Isn't that interesting? Fan favorite, uh... One. I didn't actually realize this actually, like, had, um... Levels. I really didn't. <laughs> God, I'm stupid. I know, um, uh, Ruthless Aggression. <coughs> uh, level 1 four times, and level 3, Jesus Christ. Twice. <laughs> Jesus! Jesus! Okie dokie, bruh. And then there's what's title management? Oh. Oh, and some titles did change. I did make championships, and some titles did change hands. So, pretty cool with that. So, I originally Lou, um, originally Ryback was the Intercontinental Champion, but I, but I just, ugh. I can't stand seeing some. I can't. I can't stand seeing him as a champion. Just no. So I basically gave it to Luke Harper. Um. And, um, I, I think I will do, like, another episode to where I'll, I'll go more into this. I gotta just, like, show you, like, the championships, and I'll show you all of, well, not really the championships, but I'll just kind of show you everything, like, in the universe or something like that. Um. Most of these are vacant, although, uh, the Divas champion... The original champion was Nikki, and it changed a lot. Changed from Nikki to, I think, Paige? I don't remember. To me, to Layla, to... to and, and I mean, right now, Stephanie's the Divas champion, so I... I can't even remember, uh, how it went exactly. Okay, and then the Women's Championship was vacant, so now it is at, so now it is under Summer Rae's hands. And right now I'm the NXT Women's Champion. There's like there's an oh okay I created champions. Uh, uh the Ultra Violent Women's Champion. Uh Paige is that champion. The Ultra Violent Champion is Sami Zayn. And then the Women's Champion. Uh the WWE Women's Champion. The the new the current look for the Women's Champion is Emma. Isn't that like, guys? Um, that's for all championships, and this, these are these are all just single championships. It's basically just majority. Then there's superstar. A lot of these are vacant, but I'll um, I'll be able I'll make sure at least a good amount of them, good portion of them, actually get used. There's now one, two, three, five women, different kinds of women's championships. So that's amazing. Some for tag, okay. It's just the WWE Tag Team Championship from 2002 to 2010. World Tag Team Championship 1997 to 2002. And then WT WCW. Okay. Eh, WCW, uh, it was meh. Although ECW was even crappier. Okay, and then I have three custom championships. That's basically it, so I just wanted to kind of give you guys a little peek on that. I, I don't know. I think I might just do random, random gameplays. Just to kind of show you guys everything. The everything. So, I hope you guys enjoy this. And if you did, go ahead and hit that like button. Um, and, um, 
you know, and, um, and if you want to see more content from me, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and, you know, see more stuff, more gaming content from me. It'll be pretty cool. It'll be lit. You guys are gonna love it. And, um, I hope you guys enjoy this. It, is, it has been serious. I right, you right over here, right up your alley, right up your corner. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.